Oppenheimer, Christopher Nolan's masterful biopic, transcends the limitations of a typical historical drama. Instead, it plunges us into the multifaceted mind of J. Robert Oppenheimer, the father of the atomic bomb, revealing a man riddled with brilliance, burdened by regret, and haunted by the weight of his creation. The film isn't a linear biography, but a kaleidoscope of moments reflecting Oppenheimer's life. We encounter his youthful genius, the crucible of the Manhattan Project, the scorching trial questioning his loyalty, and the lingering anxieties that consumed him. Nolan's fragmented approach doesn't feel disjointed, it mirrors the fractured psyche of a man grappling with the consequences of his decisions. Killian Murphy delivers a career-defining performance as Oppenheimer. He embodies the physicist's intellectual intensity, his moral quandaries, and his devastating self-awareness. We see in his eyes the thrill of scientific discovery, the agony of ethical dilemmas, and the crushing realization of how his work altered the course of history. Nolan's visual artistry is breathtaking. He recreates the Los Alamos laboratory with gritty realism, and the bomb test sequences are visceral and haunting. He issues CG, opting for practical effects that sear into the viewer's memory. This commitment to authenticity heightens the film's emotional impact. The supporting cast shines as well. Matt Damon portrays General Groves, Oppenheimer's military counterpart, with steely determination and a hint of desperation. Robert Downey Jr. lends his gravitas to Louis Strauss, the ruthless politician who orchestrates Oppenheimer's downfall. Emily Blunt and Florence Pugh captivate as the women who shaped Oppenheimer's personal and professional journeys. Oppenheimer is not a film that offers easy answers. It confronts the complexities of war, scientific progress, and human ambition. It doesn't shy away from Oppenheimer's flaws, nor does it attempt to paint him as a simple hero or villain. Instead, it compels us to grapple with the ambiguities of his legacy and the enduring questions it raises about scientific responsibility and the cost of progress. In conclusion, Oppenheimer is a cinematic triumph. It's a thought-provoking exploration of a pivotal historical figure, a visual feast for the senses, and a powerful reflection on the human capacity for both creation and destruction. This is not just a biopic, it's a masterpiece that demands to be seen, discussed and remembered.